Turning to Okaloosa County, in an update, the identity of a man who was found lifeless in the Gulf of Mexico has been released. Police say the victim is 63-year-old Rogelio Moreno Gaishin of Lawrenceville, Georgia. According to his family members, he had been off swimming by himself. Deputies say they spotted the man floating face down around 445 on Friday evening near a restaurant on Scenic Highway 98 in Destin. Destin Beach safety workers immediately began life-saving measures but were unsuccessful. Also in Okaloosa County, authorities say they are searching for a suspect of armed robbery. On Friday, deputies say the victim was approached at a gas station by a man who says he was hungry, homeless, and needed a ride. On the way to a nearby restaurant, the victim says the man told him to pull over and then pulled out a gun to demand money. According to the sheriff's office, the man ran from the scene after an employee of the restaurant came outside. Now, the person involved is described as a black male, approximately six feet tall, in his 20s, wearing no shirt and blue jeans. Anyone with any information is asked to call the Okaloosa County Sheriff's Office. Now, back in Bay County, a local teacher arrested and charged with child abuse. On May 14th, Panama City Police arrested Justin McClendon. They say he would pick up a juvenile and drive her to his home. There, police say he would smoke marijuana and encourage the minor to do so as well. Police say McClendon would also kiss her on the mouth. The report also states McClendon is a school teacher and the victim is one of his students. News 13 dug a little deeper and found McClendon listed as an employee of the Palm Bay Prep Academy. We reached out to Palm Bay and waiting to hear back for confirmation. McClendon is being charged with child abuse and has since been released on bond.